says hello there. So you came to see a few fabric samples for your wardrobe uh, line that you'd like to create. And I'm so happy you decided to come to see us today, Nick of Time Textiles, because we do offer a large selection of organic fabrics. So I'm really, really happy about that. Please excuse the, the assistant. She likes to wear very clingy jewelry. Um, Jane, Jane, please stop clinging your jewelry, sweetie. Oh, you have fleas? Sorry about that. Let me just go um, ask my assistant to please stop making all that noise. Okay, you're going to stop? Okay. Thank you, Jane. All right. I may have to ask her to remove her jewelry. All right, she's laying down. She feels warm. Okay, she's kind of messing up my video. But anyway, let's look at these textiles. Um, we have uh, several, as I mentioned, a variety of many textiles that you can choose from and in a variety of colors. All right, Jane, would you like to go out and do some shopping for a new, uh, new sewing machine? Okay, just a moment. I I'm sorry about that. I'm going to uh, be giving her some petty cash so that she can go out and buy a sewing machine for me. Okay, she's lying down again. So the first, now we have different, as I mentioned, and I do apologize for the delay. We have some organic cottons. We also use... Uh, cotton blends. We have some bamboo and some hemp uh, fabrics made from bamboo and hemp. Uh, very large variety, as you can see. And very beautiful colors. Some are just natural colors. You can use organic dyes to give them the color you want. So let's start, for example, with this one. This one is an organic jersey. Organic jersey is very useful for t-shirts. It is 100% cotton, as you can see, and the current price as of today, August 11, 2018, uh, is appearing on here. Uh, and we have a variety of colors. We have the lightest color, which is white. We have sort of a more sky blue. Actually, this looks kind of pinkish. I don't know if it's the lighting. It's very light pink, apparently. We have sort of a sky teal, a sort of a teal color. The petty cash, you're asking? Okay, one moment. I'm going to send her off. One moment. Thank you for waiting for me. Let's begin again. So the organic jersey, as you can see, is very soft. It's sort of a t-shirt uh, as far as the thickness. It's a t It would be a, a t-shirt um, quality fabric. Here we have sort of an ivory. This one, after all, is the white one. The top one, apparently, is a very light pink. This is the white. Then we have sort of an off-white, which is this one. You can also see here we have a more beige underneath that. Oops, I got caught. Here we are. You can see here the beige. I don't know if the... Let me hold it to the light. It appears to be the lighting better there. And we have a, a little bit darker beige, which I believe they've attached upside down. Here's the right side. You know, we have the right sides and the wrong sides of the fabric. And then we have the last one is sort of another off-white. We have several off-white colors. So this is the organic jersey. And there you see the information if you'd like to order it. It's right there. Next we have organic knit. Now this is organic knit, it's 100% silk. And, oops, it's just 
is this one? It's an organic knit, so it's 100% silk, but because of the way it is knit, it is machine knit, it gives it a stretch, but there's absolutely no elastic included. There's no leg lycra or any. It is 100% knit, and because of the type of, of way that they manufactured it, they were able to make a stretch to it. And it's quite, for being 100% silk, it's quite sturdy. So again, I wouldn't throw it in the washing machine, but if you were to make a t-shirt out of this fabric, uh, you could. And it would be a, sort of a fitted look. And it's still silk, which is a, a breathable, natural fabric, easy to dye. That's the, the nice thing about organic 100% natural fabrics are they take dyes much easier than the, you know, polyesters and those not non-organic fabrics or non non-vegetable or animal fabrics. Uh, our next group of fabrics are these interlock. Also, I believe it doesn't say 100% cotton, but I believe this is 100% cotton. Uh, jersey. Again, this cotton is stretchy. It's not like the one I showed you earlier. This one has a little bit of stretch. They come in some really cute, some really cute designs. Um, you can see here this one is hearts. Underneath we have some uh, stars. These look like the maybe to make baby clothes and you want your child to have organic, soft cotton. It's, it's very soft. It would not be irritating to the skin. We have one with cars on it. Upside down, but very cute. Then we have ones with um, flowers. So, you know, you choose the one that you think is prettiest. I like these flowers a lot. If I had a little dress that I was going to make for a little girl, I would make it out of this. A cute little onesie or, a, or just a dress, you know, a t-shirt dress is perfect for babies, you know. That's that one. Again, that's interlock. It, the interlock refers to the way it's created, the way it's manufactured. The, the fibers are are knitted together a certain way and it gives it a slight stretch which is what interlock does. Our next group of fabrics is this is organic knit and it's a cotton modal blend. Now from what I understand modal is not organic so the cotton is organic. It says organic knit so I don't remember how modal is made. I'll have to double check on that for you, and I do apologize. But, and this one comes in two colors. You can get it in white or in dark blue. And this is the right side. I was just showing you the wrong side of the fabric, but this is the right side. It's very dark blue. It's almost, it could almost be mistaken for black, but it is navy blue. And this is the white. And I'm hoping that the lighting is working here. And quite see-through, as you can see. It's very thin. It's not thick like the, the previous fabric that I showed you. Let me just show you again. This is the 100% cotton. As you can see, it's not see-through. It's, it's a little thicker, more like a t-shirt, a, re a regular t-shirt. Now we have an organic knit and modal as well. Knit fabrics, you can, you can tell it's a rib. This is ribbed. It's called ribbed. Now ribbing is always much stretchier, as you saw also with the silk. Uh, that's just that one. Cotton modal blend. Two one. Two one is the rib, meaning it's two knit stitches, one purl stitch, two knit stitches, one purl stitch. Uh, of course, done by a machine. You don't hand knit fabrics like this, but it's the same principle as whether you're knitting by hand or on a machine, just that these are little threads rather than yarn. The next one, this one's an interesting one, if you didn't know, bamboo and lycra blend. Now, lycra is not 
a natural fabric, but bamboo is. Bamboo is a very thick grass. It's, it's a member of the grass family. And this is, it appears to be either a one-one knit or just interlock, an interlock stitch, which is a stitch you do by, mach by machine. Slightly see-through, uh, very breathable. Organic is a very cool, breathable fabric. It, I've been told, I've never worn a bamboo, um, I've never worn a bamboo t-shirt or clothing, but I've been told it's very, very fresh, very, f uh, allows airflow, so it's good for hot environments, very, you know, tropical environments, because it, it, there's a lot of breathability and fresh. So that, that's an interesting, and this one is bamboo lycra. So it won't be as fresh as the 100% bamboo, which is coming up. I've got plenty more fabrics here. This one is 50-50. It's cotton modal. And this one appears to be two of the same. Maybe they accidentally... Okay, no, it's the same one. Just that the wrong sides are outward. So that's a 50-50 cotton modal. And if you'd like to order any of these fabrics, you can go directly to the website, which I think is appearing on these tickets. Or you can get in touch with me. I, I'm thinking about buying wholesale from the company, so I may be able, depending, you know, if it's a fabric that I also am interested in buying, uh, you might mention it to me, and I maybe could get it for less expensive than the real retail price. The price showing up here is retail price. Uh, or just go to the website and they, they must have other fabrics as well as these. These are just some of the very many fabrics they have. I requested samples of the organic fabrics that they had to offer. This one is 100% bamboo. I really like that one. Uh, it's sort of like a thin sweatshirt material, this particular one. And, again, if you'd like to dye the fabric, it's possible. It's very easy to dye because it's 100% uh, bamboo, which is a natural fiber. You know, it grows out of the ground and then they process it. And I like it's got some stretch, a little bit of stretch, and it's, if you wanted to make a t-shirt, in my opinion, uh, I'm sorry, a sweatshirt, it's even nicer because the backing is not fuzzy. It's actually knitted in, so it's not going to leave fuzz on you. It's very, it would make a very high quality sweatshirt of medium weight. It's not the thick, thick sweatshirts. But it's one that I really, I'm thinking about buying a large quantity of this one. I'm going to look at my budget to create a line of sweatshirts. Uh, all right, there you go. There's the information if you choose to buy it. Here's a rib organic knit. And these are all different colors of rib, ribbing, which is, again, t-shirt material. 100% cotton, and you can see all the colors here. And I'll just try to flip. It's hard to grab onto them, but I'm going to just quickly flip through the colors so that you can see all the colors. That's an interesting one. The navy blue again, which is almost borderline gray-black. It's a very interesting color, that one. Uh, here's sort of a beige. Oh, the next one looks nice. Look at that one. I hope the lighting is letting you appreciate the colors. I don't know if it... Let me try to open. Are we seeing it good? Let me open this a little bit, some natural light in. Yeah, I need to find a better place to film, I think. Here, is that... Uh, that's actually worse, because it's creating shadows, so... Anyway, let's continue. The next one is a brown color. Yeah, no, you're not a 
appreciating that color. I'm looking in the viewfinder. It's, I think I need to hold it up high, closer or something. Okay, the next one is sort of a dusty, dusty rose, a dark dusty rose, or maybe it's not fuchsia. It's a maybe dusty fuchsia. You know, it's not a bright color. It's a dusty color, they call it. And then the last one in this batch is this sort of light blue, light blue color. Okay, so again, this is that group of fabrics. Now we have this one, just one. It's called hemp. This one is hemp and lycra blend. Hemp, again, is a very natural, it's natural. Hemp is, uh, I think that's what marijuana is made from, so you can't get more natural than that. I don't know if it's hemp, or no, maybe hemp is a different, but it's in the marijuana family. But in this case, hemp is not something that's used to make drugs. It's fabric, you make rope, twine, and quite soft, because it's obviously, hemp is, a, is kind of a harsh, um, material when you're using it for twine but in this case it's quite soft very stretchy because it's it's got the lycra, lycra blend uh, and it would probably be easy to dye uh, maybe the lycra would impede the dye somewhat you might probably have to use a very strong mordant which is a good idea with any dyeing you do using a mordant because even on natural fabrics if you don't use a mordant the dye washes off. We have this one. You can read uh, what it is. It's bamboo thermal, also 100%. I love the bamboo. It's 100% bamboo. It's knit in a way, you know, waffle. It's a waffle knit. Gives it that stretch. It's what thermal underwear is made out of. So. Because of the knit, it would be warmer. If it were a simple knit, you know, just um, without the bumps, basically, a simple knit will just give you a flat surface. It's fresh. But knitting it in this manner, the stitches interlock with each other and overlap each other, so you, you get a warmer um, blend, but also very, uh, very thin. So you would be combining so in the case of bamboo, depending on how the knit is, is, is put together, you can make it very warm, you know, warmer or not, you know, or, or fresher. But I'm very drawn to the bamboo knits. I really like the idea of using bamboo. And, uh, you know, bamboo is not, is not something that... It grows very quickly. It grows everywhere, uh, you know, in the tropical climates. It's not something that's endangering the life. You know, when you cut bamboo, sure, there might be little animals in the forest, but bamboo grows back, grows back quickly. It's not like other large trees in the forest, for example, palm oil trees, where you're endangering wildlife when you cut them down and things. Bamboo is basically a very, very thick, tall grass. And it grows very quickly, you know. So there's no danger of bamboo uh, going out of going out of uh, of ex existence. It's it grows, you know, within days. It's back. It's a, it's actually considered a pest to some place, some people. And our last one again, 100% cotton. I wonder what the difference between this one is and the one I showed earlier. This is rib organic. This is organic interlock. Okay, yeah, this one's a little thicker. Not quite sweatshirt material. It's like a thicker t-shirt because of the way it's the same. So as you can see, I'll show you the two close together because at first I mistook them, but this one is definitely thicker. A heavyweight t-shirt as opposed to a lightweight t-shirt would be the difference. This would be a lightweight t-shirt and this is a thicker t-shirt thicker weight t-shirt and let me see if there was another one and then I'll show you all the colors another 100% cotton no it's just these two there was the knit there's cotton jersey that's also 100% cotton so 
so we'll compare these three. These three are actually, all three are 100% cotton, except there's Jersey, which is a little bit more flexible, a little lighter weight. The second one, as far as weight, is the uh, rib, yeah, the ribbing, the rib organic knit is a little bit lighter weight, a little stretchier. That's the difference. This one is, no, this one's pretty stretchy too. It's just that this is a regular knit. This one was knit a little more thickly. You know, with the rib knit, it thickens it a bit. Just It's just the way the threads overlap. And the last one is a, the thickest weight. It's also 100% cotton. No difference between the fabric, but um, because it's an interlock, it makes it thicker. It's thicker than ribbing because the the not ribbing is, uh, you know, you know how ribbing is. I mean, here's an example of a thicker of a wider ribbing. So that's how that one is knit. Except you can't tell because it's one, 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 one. Interlock the the threads are actually interlocking with each other, so it gives it some stretch and thickness. It's the 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 knit is actually. Um, overlapping to some extent, sort of like the waffle, but in a different um, series of knit. Okay, so here are the colors of this one. So if you want a thick t-shirt, more like a winter, winter, you know, or maybe even thermal underwear, this would be a better choice. And some nice bright colors on this one, which is nice. You see there. So I really hope you'll look us up here at Nick of Time Fabrics. I'm actually not an employee. Uh, I ordered, I requested the samples and I really do enjoy looking through them and now I know up close which ones I'm going to want to order. So, so please let me know if you're interested in any of these and I can see about, you know, purchasing in quantity it might might make it cheaper for both of us or if you want to buy on your own of course you can just go straight to the website does it appear there yeah here it is www.nickoftime.net is the website so i really do appreciate you coming today and seeing our design studio and looking into the fabrics let me know which ones you'd like for your clothing line and we'll work on that together with the design in our next meeting. Bye-bye. Thanks for coming.